What up, what up? Wimbush here, and today I'm excited to show you guys Unreal Engine, my new secret weapon when it comes to motion graphics. Now, Unreal Engine is a program that you can't ignore, so today I'm gonna to show you guys the power of this engine and why you as motion designers should be excited. Let's talk about how we as artists can utilize the unbelievable tech known as Unreal Engine. If you read my article here in School of Motion or even watched the Unreal Engine 5 hype video a few weeks ago, you know that Unreal is all the buzz right now. You may be thinking, how can I use real-time rendering to speed up my workflow? Or maybe, are studios actually using this technology? Well, the answer is yes. Yes, they are. To give a clearer picture, check out Capacity. Capacity is a motion design studio that's been cranking out high-level content using Unreal Engine for game trailers and even conference openers. Capacity is a perfect example of how you can use Unreal Engine and motion graphics to create high-end animation. From creating CG trailers for Rocket League and Magic the Gathering, to even creating broadcast packages for the Primax Game Awards, the team at Capacity will tell you that Unreal Engine was essential in the workflow. The speed of real-time rendering capabilities allowed them to create changes from the feedback received from the clients almost instantly. During this year's NAB, I took part in C4D Live and created a show opener for the event. This was a showcase of working between Cinema 4D and Unreal Engine. Check out this animation, excuse me, Nick's award-winning animation, and remember, this was only possible because of the power of Unreal Engine. For those After Effects users out there, I just finished a logo animation for Grant Boxing using similar techniques. I even sprinkled a little After Effects in there to polish everything up and to give it that professional sheen. Unreal Engine can be used alongside the applications you already know and love today to create something awesome. Think about this scenario. You already created your motion graphics piece for your client using Unreal Engine and all your assets are already there, right? Wouldn't it be cool to offer your client more bang for their buck? Since your assets are already built out in Unreal Engine and it's a real-time rendering program, you could use that project you created to create new experiences iterated from your existing project. Think augmented reality or even virtual reality. Let's take it one step further and put the ever so popular green screen on a podium. Green screen tech has been a crucial staple on Hollywood magic for decades. But the pre-production has to be tight, and poor production methods can create costly mistakes. But what if post-production started in the earlier production phases, introducing virtual sets? Environments in Unreal Engine are linked to cameras on set, then displayed on massive screens behind the talent. This virtually eliminates the need for green screen while laying the powers of post-production in the hands of the director. Don't like the way the scene looks? Maybe the color of the lights don't mesh with your set pieces. Real-time rendering offers an opportunity to instantly make these changes. Post-production artists are there in the beginning, calling out what issues are going to pop off and making suggestions during filming. Unreal Engine is definitely changing the landscape for what's possible in our field. The best news is that Epic Games has made this magical piece of software 100% free for anyone that wants to use it. Whether it's VFX, motion graphics, live production, 3D, Basically anything that doesn't involve creating a video game. And even if video game development is your passion, the software is still free until you generate $1 million in revenue. Our industry changes fast, so it's a great time to future-proof yourself in the field and get a head start in this emerging tech. Companies like Digital Domain, Disney, Industrial Light & Magic, the NFL Network, the Weather Channel, Boeing, and even motion design studios like Capacity are all using Unreal Engine. School of Motion is excited to explore the future of MoGraph, so it's a safe bet to expect more content about Unreal Engine. If you'd like to learn anything specific or know more of interesting tech, hit us up. We'd love to geek out. So I hope that got you excited because we've only scratched the surface of what Unreal Engine could do, so I'll definitely be back to show you the impact that this amazing engine can have on your workflow. So until next time, stay fresh, keep creating, and I'll catch you in the next video. Take care.